reporting live from a date night. A date day. Me and Harv are secretly a bit pissed. And I probably shouldn't be starting my, my vlog here, but I am. Me and Harvey went to... Why is my hair doing this? Emily, just talk and get... get sorry, sorry. You're a vlogger, this is what you're meant to do. Don't get, don't get like, distracted by your face. Me and Harvey went to Madison Rooftop, which is Circa. Just up there. Over there. Look how nice this is, by the way. It's now 9 o'clock and we've been there since 3. I'm sorry, that is not right. <laughs> And so basically we decided to walk home because we were like it's such a nice evening. It's one of the nicest evenings ever in London. So we walked home. It's a bit. What? That's not fine. Sorry, that we are um, public. And we keep pretending that we're tourists, so every like iconic bit we go past, we're taking photos. So I'm gonna leave a screen a screenshot, a snapshot here. Because we've not been into central London for like the, like a year and a half since lockdown, really, and had a proper walk around, and, and we've just been stuck in the southwest. And I've never drunk this. It's actually so nice. But it's a. We're talking St Paul's. We're talking Big Ben. We're talking Hate Modern, the Gherkin, the Merkin, I'm the Flurkin. I'm exhausted. Well, St Paul's Bridge. Um, whilst is Big Ben, I'm not talking about my penis. Talking about Big Ben, and the look at all clock the, um, and everything. Mosquitoes. They're, they're seagulls, then. No, they're. Oh, it's Sunday night. You're really good at this thing. I've got, I've got work to do tomorrow, so that'll be fun. Cheese grater. Do you know why they call it that? It's a walkie-talkie, actually, mate. No, no, because it's brand new. Look how nice that is. The sun's on it. I don't know what this is. It is so rogue. It's a vodka. I've never had it before. A raspberry and rose vodka. It tastes like flowers in a cup. Hence why I'm loving it. At the camera, we just film. Emily's reaction to McDonald's, she's going to get all excited about it. Let's put this here. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> McDonald's, man. Why are you this? Isn't that right? I was filming your, was filming your reaction. I knew you'd get all excited. I said, I said you'd do this. I did, didn't you? That's what I did. No. That's exactly what you did, yeah. Right, so we'll do a little unboxing. Um, this is our McDonald's order for those who are wondering. Oh, oh, oh look how puffy I am. This isn't the alcohol. I'm oh, so I've got the worst hay fever. It's doing me bad. Oh, Where are my drinks? There's... Oh my god! It's forgotten the drinks. No. And they're soggy. Oh my god! I'm absolutely PF. Yeah, after watching We've Seaspiracy. We've got some chicken barbecue something or other, chicken nuggets. What the fuck is chicken this? Mate. Why have you got three burgers? I only got two burgers. No, no, no. Oh, these little mini minky mans. Yeah, I did all that. Oh my god, yeah, these are so I'm good. actually so I got an oasis and it's not here. Yeah, I got, where my drinks? I got complained. I'll get them a refund. That is, that is, that is. Can I have a good. refund of six pound fifty please? Good morning, everyone. I'm now sober and coherent. <laughs> Oh my god, yes, it was so fun. I literally, we laughed a lot. I start here, welcome back to my vlog, because, I mean, yesterday I was a little bit tiddly. Um, I honestly went to Madison Rooftop, and I felt like I was in Ibiza. I got overexcited and had way too many porn star martinis. But what a laugh, I was in bed by 10, to be honest. So, I feel fine today. I'm actually, currently, on my way, I'm about to leave, to go get some lymphatic drainage, which I get really bad water retention, and apparently this is just meant to solve it, and it's meant to be unreal. So, I'm gonna let you guys know how that is. It is now quarter past six, and I completely forgot to vlog my day. Very sorry about that, but lymphatic drainage massage is literally, it was unreal. Basically, cut a long story short what it is is all the water retention that we store in our bodies is to do with our lymph nodes and basically they get trapped i think and they all hang on they get trapped. yeah they kind of like basically need pushing back into the heart to then get pumped back around our system 
the things that cause it are drinking alcohol, aka last night. Um, so she was like, as soon as I went in there, she was like, you drank yesterday, didn't you? Well, I was like, guilty. It's alcohol, hormones, and not drinking not enough water, which I actually thought water, like when I drank loads of water, I felt really like full and like I was carrying water, but she said, no, we have to drink water to flush all the toxins out. It's so important. So I'm gonna just go, bu go buy myself a big litre, because I'm so bad at drinking water. So I'm gonna go buy myself a big one litre bottle, get that down me by the end of today. And basically this week, just try get a bit more water into my routine. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm gonna leave Flavia's link, because guys, if you really do struggle with water retention or you feel like you do, it, it is fabulous. I feel very light. I feel, I feel, I feel great. Good morning, everyone. I've literally just jumped out of the shower. I look clinically unwell. I've got a very exciting week to eat. It's a new day. It's Monday. I mean, the last time I vlogged was last week. It was meant to be a weekly vlog. It's not happened. So we're starting again this week. First things first, sort my lid out. I'm about to go to the dentist because um, I'm getting my new aligners. And I'm getting my brackets put on as well. So that's exciting. Big, big news for me. So I'm finally dressed and looking semi-normal. I've decided not to put much makeup on today. Just because I'm, I'm not feeling it. I mean, have you seen the weather outside? It is absolutely foul. I cannot believe this is what we have to deal with this summer. And I don't know if any of you get this. But tell me if I'm wrong. But I actually get really bad headaches and i don't know if this is a thing or if it's not a thing but when it's really cloudy and hazy like this i get a constant headache anyone else relate comment below if you can or is it just me maybe i need to go see to the doctors if so actually it was so bad yesterday that i had like a really bad like brain fog that i actually went to get a covid test because i was like Say if I was going to see my family and I was like, oh my God, say if I've got COVID. So I've heard people get like brain fog or whatever. It's like, oh my God, I've got brain fog. Anyway, got my negative test today and I took a lateral flow before I left. We're all good, we're in the clear. So this video is kindly sponsored by Decenio and I'm very excited because I've got some lovely new pictures which I'm gonna spruce the flat up with. So I'm still deciding on where to put them. You can't really see this false one, but it looks like that. I'm still deciding where they are going to go. I actually have really, really nice summer prints. So if you're looking to give your give your walls a bit of a summery spruce, then definitely check them out. Um, I'll leave the code below in the description box, and I'm going to show you what they look like once they're on the wall. We currently have this guy hanging up the, on the wall, which is also, I think, from Decenio. But actually, we found him by the bins um, when we moved in, and we just we popped him up there. But I'm thinking these two green ones are going to go up there to match the sofa. I mean, the sofa needs a good puff. And um, these two here, I'm thinking, I don't know, I'm going to see what they look like. Harv's going to put them up for me, just here, opposite these guys. So what do we reckon? I'll show you what they look like up once we've done that. That's going to be on Harvey's to-do list today, isn't it, Harv? Right, gang, I'll be honest with you. I've got my new attachments on. My next appointment's not till October, so watch this space. It's going to be very, very, I'm going to have straight teeth by October. I don't lie, I'm actually really struggling today. I feel really flat. Like, I literally just want to sit on the sofa and watch movies all day. No motivation. I'm feeling a bit negative and a bit down. But that's fine. But I thought, you know what, I may as well vlog it because, and tell you guys that, because I don't want you to think that I'm happy all the time. I'm happy most of the time, but I do have down days. And I'm having one of those today, which is just... I spoke to my mum, though, and she said she's having the same. And we've come to the conclusion that it is because of the weather. I'm blaming everything on the weather lately. Um, so that's great. But yeah, I'm going to... What I'm going to do is I'm having a slow day. But I'm going to sort out my flat a bit. Give it a good clean. I'm going to... And then I'm going to put up my pictures. Yeah, that's going to be my day today. So for dinner tonight, I am making us a chicken, mushroom, and onion risotto. Look at us go. Half is going to start putting up my wonderful pictures. So 
and then I need to pack for tomorrow because tomorrow oh, I'm going on a little staycation with a girlfriend of mine. And we're going to Soho alive. Farmhouse. I also just wanted to say, I'm sorry, I've just put my glass on. Sorry if this vlog does, I feel like I'm talking and not really making a lot of sense today. So do excuse me. Um, these are already, I can already tell these are gonna look fab. Much better than before. I'm very, very excited about this situation. <clears throat> See how my risotto is coming along. Oh my god, look, it's bubbling. I'm such a messy cook. Is anyone else a messy cook? Guys, so this is what these ones look like. Look how well it matches my sofa. I think that looks fab, much better than before. I'm gonna leave links for these as well in the description box below. Oh, they look like in the hallway, which, Got those ones on that wall. Those ones on that wall. I absolutely love this. I think it's so cool. It's like a bit pop arty. Good vibes only, because that's all we want in this flat. But yeah, I'm gonna leave my code and just in, and everything that you need in the description box below. Like I said before, love them. So we have arrived. Look how cute this is. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> Oh my god, this is the cutest little thing I've ever stayed in all my life. So this is our current setup. Cheers. Ching ching. <laughs> One bottle of rose down. Hello. Welcome to my humble home. Oh my god, look how nice this is. We're very wholesome right now. I could sit here all day. I might even move in. Mm. Yeah? Fancy it? Me too. Just That's live it. in this little hut for the rest of our lives. Oh my god, and also I'm obsessed with Jeremy Clarkson at the moment. I watched his farm. That's all she keeps going on about. So basically, we're in Chipping Norton, where his farm is. I don't know if you guys have watched it on Amazon Prime, but if you haven't, you need to watch it. It's called Clarkson's Farm. And I'm just basically obsessed with his farm shop and his whole like vibe. So we're gonna, I've made Maz, she's gonna drive me to this the farm shop. On the way home, can we please go to Jeremy Clarkson's farm Although shop? Although apparently the queues to get into his farm shop were two hours long today. Two hours to get to Diddley Squat Farm. Diddley Squat? That's what I might squat there and see what they say. <laughs> I might squat outside. The squat is right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Also, guys, I think my teeth are actually straighter. A little bit. Well, not on the bottom, but the top. What do you think? Can you notice the difference? Anyway. Right, I'm gonna get off this now and drink some more rose. Bye. So we are now in bed watching Bridget Jones. Loving life. It's. I feel very cozy. Waking up here really is not a bad situation. Just sitting here, having a little, oh, my phone just fell on the floor, having a little morning coffee, trying to psych ourselves up because we said that we would go to the gym. This is the current scenario. Oh my God, I've got chins. But yeah, we said that we'd go to the gym, have a sauna and a steam room. So we've got to stick to that plan. Much to our despair. Yeah. Because I really can't be bothered to go to the gym right now, but I know that I'll feel better once I do it. And, then we're going shopping, so I feel like I need to feel good to go shopping. May as well use the facilities whilst we got them. Also, look at this lovely little dressing gown I'm in. A very, very cosy stuff. And blue skies. Today is going to be a very, very good day. Our little higher fee at 500. Yeah. And we are off to Vista Village. We had a lovely breakfast. I did go to the gym. Well, we both did. So I'm feeling good. Got my retainers back in living that brace life. So we have arrived at Vista Village and we're currently, I'm speaking quite quietly because I feel like it's quite a quiet place. Um, currently living the dream, guys. <laughs> I really have smashed it today. Um, we are sitting here having a glass of champagne at the apartment, which is like this little posh area where you can basically, I think you have to be invited, I'm not sure, but I'm a pretty big deal these days. What can I say? <laughs> You're an idiot. <laughs> oh. these days. I mean, jokes on me, because you probably don't have to be invited. I'm just giving it a big one. But yeah, I'm sitting here having another glass of champagne. Life is great. I really have enjoyed myself. <laughs> Can't wait to uh, hide all my bags from Harvey when I get in as well. Because he'll <laughs> have a go at me about my shopping addiction. It's an emotional time for us. We're saying goodbye to our little hire car. 
<laughs> the trip's over. I'm so sad. Although we did buy some lovely, lovely things, which I'll show you once we get home. I'm quite impressed with our purchases, aren't we, Mariella? Very impressed with our purchases. So yeah. If you guys want to hire a car, come to Kendall Cars. Kendall Cars, right there. Look, loads of vans, all sorts of stuff. It's not bad, Karen. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, I've just I've left her to do everything. <laughs> Thing. I am back from Soho Farmhouse and Vista. I literally had the nicest weekend. So I thought I would just end this vlog with a little bit of a haul because I'm guessing you guys want to see what I bought. And I like, I'm nosy and I like knowing what people bought. So I thought I may as well show you. I literally can't speak today. I'm sorry. I've got these retainers in. So I feel like I sound really silly. Also, I've, been, I had, I've had such a stressful morning this morning. I can't even tell you. My laptop decides to break on me. I have so many videos I need to edit and get out to you guys. And 101 other things I need to do. And yeah, it's it's we're having a serious technical problem. I've been on the phone to Apple about four times. Anyway, I won't bore you with that issue. It's another situation on my hands. I mean, also, this angle for me is just... It really isn't the one. I should have, like, propped you guys up a bit more. So... The first thing I got was from Prada. You know what? I didn't actually buy loads. I bought a good amount, you know? Not loads, but I didn't want to go too crazy because I just, it's not good. But I saw these shoes and I was like, I just need them. And I know I'll wear them all the time because they're really simple and classic. So I got these lovely Prada shoes they are literally like a really soft like satiny black but i just thought they are so nice and they'll go with everything i can wear them with jeans i can wear them with a dress they're black they're a win-win and these were actually like really cheap as well for product sheets they're going to be like 400 pounds but they had a scratch or like the tiniest little thing on them so they they brought them down to like 130 pounds i think they were and i was like you know what i would spend that on a night out so these coming home with me and then the same belt for years and i do wear it a lot but and it is a gucci belt so i bought myself a new gucci belt and this one it's just literally plain black but it's got this sort of gucci along the side which I just thought it was plain but also really nice. Again, we'll just go with everything, so I'll wear it all the time. Practical, you know, that's what we're dealing with this this shopping trip. I'm trying to be practical, apart from the last purchase I got, definitely. I mean, I, I didn't need it, but you know what? It made me happy, so it's another Prada purchase of mine. And it's a big one. Oh, I just love opening nice things. I'm obsessed. So I saw this and I was like, you know what? It's got it. It's coming home with me. I need it for summer. And it's this Prada beach tote thing. And it comes with a really, really nice strap. And inside it also comes with a little mini pouch too. Which, you know what? I just love. It's going to be a classic summer bag. And, um... Good for any holidays that I go on. Can't say that I'll be going on many because I have work the rest of the summer. But, you know, for next year. Or I might do a nice trip at the end of the year, to be honest with you. So, yeah. I mean, I think I can even use this in the UK as well. I can, it's like a nice little summer tote, you know? This was meant to be, I think, £900, £880. But I got it for 500 and something. Which I guess is still a lot for a bag, but it actually isn't. It, I personally think it's a bit of a bargain, so. And that is that. That's all I got for Vista. And then when I got home, I got a lovely little parcel from Fort and Reckless. So I just smacked myself in the face with this, so that's good. Um, so I thought I'd just show you what I got from these guys, because they've actually got some really nice stuff at the moment. This cute little top, which is in like a creamy colour. And it's got these like little, just thought that was nice. And then I got this, which is a, just a plain body, but I thought the back was really nice. I know it's really plain, but these were jeans. You just can't go wrong. Especially in summer when it's like cold at night, but 
So I could wear this, but no jacket because it's long sleeved. God, I'm clever. I don't know why I'm loving to Sorry, the trains are so loud. I cannot even. This dress, which is a toweling dress. I thought this was quite cool with a pair of trainers. So yeah, I just thought I'd quickly show you those because, well, they were there and I thought, oh, why not? I'll add them to the little mini haul. So yeah, my recent purchases. I'm on a shopping ban now. I'm not going to be spending any more money for the next few months. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. I hope you have enjoyed. I'm going to try and get a few more out ASAP. I know I've been a bit slack, but I've just basically been caught up with technical problems should we say so yeah please like comment and subscribe and i will see you all soon <laughs> look at this <gasps> oh i give up on life now don't i look oh my god seriously guys i can't love you all